And hello from one of the great venues in world football, the San Siro in the city of Milan. My name's Derek Ray, and delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. And the general feeling is we should be in for a spellbinding occasion. It's Milan versus ATK Mohan Bagan. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out, who will affect the game, and who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. This is the Milan starting 11. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Davide Calabria plays with Teo Hernandez in the wide defensive areas. Sandro Tonali plays alongside Ismael Benasser in central midfield. And leading the line today, Olivier Giroud. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Yeah, the same formation and the same sort of game plan. So this will all be about which individuals can get the better of their opponent. This will be a tough battle. And now they get the ball rolling. Oh, lovely incisive pass. Oh, but there's defensive diligence for you when things look dangerous. Well, they get the ball once more. Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players, he can go past people with ease, and he's got a great shot on him as well. It could be! There it is! And just the ideal start! Well, here it is again. It was a good finish, but the keeper has to do better at his near post. He was beaten far too easily on that occasion. Now well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? The Rosso Neri pushing forward with options available. Giroud. Oh, maybe the equaliser. Quite simply, an opportunity wasted. Easy for the keeper. Singh. They might be able to get in now. A terrific defending to stop them progressing. Leal. And he's in. Well, it's all going so swimmingly for them here. Another goal. And now it's a matter of avoiding any silly mistakes. Well, here it is again. And it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Benassa. It's with Diaz. Diaz. Brahim Diaz now. Giroud. Magnificent defending.
Kronic. Well, the keeper had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. short option preferred and the cross smuggled away <laughs> who can he pick out the clearance wasn't decisive. Leal. It's a good-looking ball in behind. A goal! Just what they needed! Still plenty of life in this match! Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. So underway once more. This is far from being in the bag. Milan making sure of that. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? Benassa. It's with Diaz. Diaz. Oh, he's really opened them up here. And there is the goal. He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Well, here's the replay. It all starts with the delivery into the box. Just begging someone to get on the end of it. And the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? Three, two it is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? Sing. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Excellent ball towards the front post. The end product just wasn't there. And he could be in proper trouble here. Oh, keeper dealt with it. Let's see about the delivery. And the keeper won't be complaining about that corner kick delivery. His ball all the way. And there we have it. The first half comes to an end here at the San Siro.
Well, quite simply, he hasn't been able to make his mark an attack in this game, Stuart. Yeah, he's been well marshalled so far, but he hasn't worked the defenders or the goalkeeper hard enough. He's got to impose himself on this game, otherwise they're going to struggle to get back into this. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Oh, fancy footwork. Beautifully disguised ball. Oh, but he's done brilliantly to cut it out. Rade Krunic. Davide Calabria. Sloppy in possession from Milan. Singh. Over the touchline for a throw in. Take it away. Nasser Leal credit to them for winning back possession well there you can see it the visitors haven't been able to control possession but when they have had it they've looked so oh, the chances on Stuart oh my goodness he's caught that so well a goal of the highest class fantastic technique Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, but you have to question the defending here. They don't attack the ball when it comes in. They don't react quick enough to close the scorer down. It's really poor defending. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Ben Asser. Davide Calabria. Well, he's given us away. Leal. Well, the supporters think it's on. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Calabria. He's got the right idea with that pass. And it all counts for naught. Leal. Oh, he's gone for goal. Well, it wasn't quite as dangerous as I thought it might be. Almost at full time, and I'll tell you what, playing away from their home patch has been a pleasant experience for them, Stuart. Well, they've been much the better side up to now. Some of their approach play has been excellent. They just need to control possession for these final few minutes to cap off a really good display. Rafael Leao. Tonali with it. Hernandez shielding the ball superbly and they need to get tighter and he might profit here oh great defending
Davide Calabria. Tonali with it. Van Assa. Sandro Tonali. Rade Krunic. It's with Diaz. Calabria. Diaz. Leal. Must be. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. And there goes the final whistle. A result Milan fans won't want to dwell upon. A defeat for them. Your assessment of the performance. Well, Derek, the fans are right to expect more. The tempo of their passing was too slow. They were second to the ball too many times and were beaten by the better side today. Well, he put in a really thorough performance here, Stuart. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.